how do you and your food choices impact climate change and the sustainable future? Uh, my name is Roger Basin. The company is AOA, Atlantic Ocean Aquaculture. And we're uh, looking to solve some of these problems and at the same time use an innovative funding mechanism with a huge environmental upside, creating positive change. So the three key questions are, what is our financing strategy? Why are ocean farms important? And how do they work? So on the financing strategy, we're working with a crowdfunder called Rabble, uh, based in Manhattan. And uh, the, the mechanism, to simplify that statement a little bit, is um, a uh, SEC-approved preferred equity that uh, model that um, produces uh, or returns 8 to 10 percent interest in a six-year term. Uh, the, um, in other words, the farms, the uh, ecological farms, uh, provide cleaning uh, ocean health with an investment and making money uh, doing it. So um, why are these farms important? Well, from our perspective, Land-based agriculture uses 8% of the Earth's surface um, and uh, it doesn't produce or will not produce sufficient uh, food to provide security for um, the growing world population that's projected to be 9 billion people in 2050. Ocean farming can using only 3 tenths of 1% of the global ocean. America can feed the world using 5% of what's called the EEZ, which is the Economic Enterprise Zone 200 miles off the coast, and create 3 million jobs um, in the process. So how do these farms work? The ocean farms um, are a designed ecosystem, like a marine permaculture, that combines shellfish and high-value seaweeds that grow in symbiotic harmony in a uh, three-dimensional ocean footprint. They uh, reduce the excess nutrients in the shorelines that cause dead zones in the ocean. Um, re they sequester carbon and reduce ocean acidification, which is accelerating at a rate 150 times pre-industrial uh, pre times. So in summary, the farms improve ocean health, they create jobs, produce very nutritious products, and uh, make money for investors.